Ciao a tutti! This is Katya and welcome back to another video. So, on today's video, it's gonna be a paint with me video and I thought of doing watercolor and um, the reason for that is it has been, I think, two years since the last time that I've actually painted with watercolor. So here we have my watercolor paper and um, usually before I start anything, I use a masking tape. Let's prepare this watercolor paper. Right now, this paper that I'm using is just from uh, Canson, this one. That is just 59 pesos. So this one is pretty okay. I mean, it's not the best, but it's fine. I actually asked my dad, I told him, um, what painting would you want to see? And he told me he wanted a papagallo, which is a parrot. So I went to Google and I found this picture as reference. I'm gonna draw this one. Maybe I will change it a bit, the position. But yeah, this is just a little study. The pencil that I will be using is an H1. So this is a 6H from Stedler. And I really like the pencils from Stedler. Um, maybe I'll use the 6H or an H1. So I don't want to use the softer pencils like B, HB. Um, they smear too much and the graphite can mix with the paper and the watercolor mixture. I'm now gonna draw. So I have just finished my sketch for the parrot and um, that took me, I think, to 15 to 20 minutes, something like that. So I will now start um, coloring this drawing. I'll be using my Windsor & Newton Cotman series. I'll be using blue, red, and yellow. So this one is an ultramarine blue and it's my favorite kind of blue to use, even with oil painting. And I've already mixed some of it here, so I think it's time to start. And um, by the way, this is the brush that I'll be using, also from Windsor & Newton, which is a round one, and it's uh, number six.
I just finished the painting and I have to say I'm really not used to using watercolor and uh, it really shows that I haven't been using it for two years and so yeah I think I think the overall result was okay I mean it's not the best I really know that I have I had a lot of uh, you know um, things that I didn't get right like maybe the background and the feet of this parrot I actually started calling it Iggy I don't know this is Iggy the parrot I don't know why I called her like that I really went too overboard with the details I'm gonna show you a picture of it but um, it's kind of funny because since I'm very used to using oil paint I think I used my techniques with oil paint with this one and it kind of helped me and kind of not in the end but um, I think overall it's uh, okay I mean not the best again and uh, let me know what you think about the final result I actually really enjoyed this one I think that's it for today's video I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you on my next one ciao ciao arrivederci